Hey guys, Antrodom here, and welcome back to another Minecraft video, and this is One Life Achiever Season 2, Episode 6, and at the end of the last episode, we had just defeated the Wither, and we were going to head off for the Ender Dragon, however, we do need to go ahead and collect ourselves a whole bunch of arrows for this fight, preferably about 64 of them, maybe we'll be able to get them in this episode because we have a looting one sword, and as you can see here, it is turning nighttime. but another day cycle has passed since the end of the last episode, I made his collar, I made Harpo's collar blue, and I added a couple of chests and I organized this area up just a little bit. Um, in this chest up here, I got like solid blocks and then wood items. Uh, in this chest, I have, you know, the items that have been mined up. In this one, I have mob drops. I have the discs and more mob drops. And in this one, I have random miscellaneous items, food related items, food items, and then my miscellaneous tools are going to go in here. So yeah, and I added a few more furnaces as well, and I'm smelting regular stone because I am OCD and I'm going to replace pretty much all of this probably at some point off screen. But anyways, without any further ado, let me go ahead and let's venture out into the night. I also added in this little staircase and I replaced the water here so that the water uh, didn't like devour my entire walkway. Ow! Ow! Okay, well you know what? I need you. Wow, does this really one-shot them? I hope it does. I hope it does. <laughs> so tonight... It's a mob killing night. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to go out and I'm going to kill as many guys as I can here. So yeah, there's a creeper under there, I think. Stuck in the stuck in the water trap is a creeper. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, let's go and let's grab the water. All right, and wow, I said let's grab the water. Let's go and let's grab his dropping. So yeah, the entire night pretty much here is going to be spent heading out that way and killing as many mobs as we can preferably like all skeletons see like any skeletons that i see they need to die because i need their arrows hopefully like every one of them will wind up dropping arrows so yeah um and probably off screen uh more than likely like i said before i'm probably going to be doing some or more organization with that area um die die oh he died by the fall and didn't take advantage of my uh, looting bonus but whatever but yeah, so at some point here, I am going to be, uh, you know, like, redoing that area a little bit, just so it looks aesthetically more pleasing. Okay, you, you need to die. Okay, what's up? Sup, skelly butt? There we go, so three arrows. We're, as long as these skeletons just keep spawning for us, and I mean, with this wide of an area, chances are we are going to get a whole bunch. Yeah, see, like, there's one right there. Like, it's not like with Endermen, where Endermen just simply don't spawn. You know, it, it, this is this is definitely okay. Okay, so then there's that one. I think maybe if I get up to 64 before the night's end, I might actually, uh, I might start, actually, you know what? Just for the heck of it here. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Come here, creeper. Creeper. You know, let's do this just the, just the once. Okay, there's that, there's that, and there's that. Okay, now back away, back away. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come here, come here. Oh god, we got, uh, we got, we got incoming fire. Got incoming fire by unwanted visitors. Okay. Oh, no, no. No, no, you don't. Okay. No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. Shoot him. Shoot him. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, and he dropped 11. That's nice. I don't think I have that disc yet. All right. Cool. Okay. And then there's the arrows. Cool. So that's awesome. There we go. We, we've gotten one step closer to our disc finding achievement. Um, even though I'm not really doing achievements in that sense anymore, I still want to try it. You know, it's still like a cool achievement in my opinion, because, uh, it's just unique. You know, it's not like I have to spend forever to do it. It's not like collecting 64 of everything or some crap like that, but this is just legitimately a cool little challenge in my opinion. So I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to continue with it. Spiders, spiders everywhere. Spare me. Oh my God. Spare me. Spare me. Okay. Just, just spare me, please. Let's make sure there's no creepers behind me. Oh god, no! I don't want the I don't want the spider. I don't, oh, they killed the skeleton. Jeez, I'm getting like the worst luck in terms of what's killing the skeletons. All right. Okay, die. Dealing with mobs is no biggie, especially with the enchantments that I now have from the wither fight. All right, so I need to I need to find more skeletons. These these mobs these mobs are pointless for me. They they do nothing but annoy me. Okay, there's another one right there. So yeah, awesome. I don't really know what to talk about though at this point now. Um, yeah, we've organized that area up, up a lot. Um, the reason why I'm kind of doing it too, it's very much like holds inspiration by David R. 64 yt otherwise known as X, who always wanted to make everything aesthetically pleasing, even if it like still felt very natural. Like it, it, if 
the materials that were used still didn't feel like it was like sugar and rainbows, you know? It's not like it has to look like a, a build that was made on creative, but just, you know, to make like the inside area more accessible, uh, maybe make like a farm inside the house or something like that, or maybe set up some kind of like farm outside or something. Um, you know for potatoes because I do have a potato now so making a potato farm won't be that big of a deal And I want to do it before 1.5 hits and as far as I know it's gonna be hitting very soon I don't know precisely how soon but very soon So yeah, the today is a battle. Yeah <laughs> What I was just thinking there what was going through my head is that by the end of this night like there's just going to be so many creeper explosions and stuff that th it's really gonna feel like this was once a battlefield Okay, all right. I've gotten enough of those. You, you are, you are what I'm looking for. Okay, I only have 11 arrows though. This isn't going as well as I hope so far. And there's an Enderman over there, but I don't think I'm gonna need him. But you know what? Let's kill him anyways. Kill the darkness that lies beyond. Die, die. Okay, you are taking a lot of hits. Jeez. Okay, well I got 200 pearls anyways. That works. Die. Cool. Alright, oh, there's a skeleton. Yep, yeah, there's... Oh, and there's a chain zombie over there. I might be able to get chain armor. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know if that's going to apply. Okay. Okay, uh, spider, you need to die. What are you holding? You're holding a bone. That's awesome. I mean, I know you picked it up, but that's still awesome. Okay, there we go. I have lots of stuff on me now, and I have another bow as well. Pointless, but whatever. Uh, let's see. Any more? Any more? I know, I know you'd be wanting to spawn, skeletons, because you are my best friend. Okay, yes, I, and yes, I know there's that spider behind me. Get, get away. Get away. You know what, cow? Shut up. Sh cow, shut up. There we go. That's what I thought. <laughs> I don't know why I felt like doing that. That cow just, it got in my way. He had to die. He had to die for his sins of being a cow. Yeah. Because as you all know, I hate cows. I hate cows because they're annoying. And they're only made even more annoying by the recent updates. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Uh, kill that creeper. Okay, that creeper needs to die. That spider needs to die. Okay. You need to die. Okay, so one shot. Two shot. No! Ah, too close. You suck for doing that. Okay, hang on. So, one shot. Two shot. And then a pickaxe shot. No, back up, back up, back up. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. No, 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 no. No, oh, thank you. Thank you, skeleton. Thank you so much. Okay, oh, you, you hit the you hit the wrong mob. Okay, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Hit him, hit him. Yeah. That's what I thought. Ooh, I didn't know you could get those from creepers. I thought those were dungeon exclusive. Oh, that means we can actually complete this achievement. That's so insane. I did not know that. Okay, you learn something new every day. Even I learn something new about Minecraft every day. Okay, one, two, and then th no, no, he started blowing up sooner than I thought. All right, let's go and let's try and kill the rest of the skeletons that we can here. Um, yeah, man, this night cycle seems like it's lasted forever. I guess. Well, they say time flies when you're having fun, but I mean, I'm having fun, and time went rather slow there. Did you drop your bow? Did you drop your bow? No, you didn't. You suck. But yeah, I really thought these, this 13 and cat were only obtainable via regular dungeons. Like, I was actually not looking forward to having to do that for the final two discs. But, you learn something new every day. Yeah. Alright, so, uh, if only there was a bed, and yes, I know there are mods for this, you don't need to say it. But, um, I really wish at this present moment there was a way. Okay, you know what, chicken? Chicken? I need your feathers for arrows. Your arrows are a worthy sacrifice. Maybe that's what I should do during the daytime now. All those chickens that I saved up that were off in that direction, I think. I th or no, there's a few off in this direction too. Uh, it's time for them to die, unfortunately. I'm sorry, chickens. I'm sorry. Did you not drop any feathers? Wow, you are a stingy hog. Okay, you, you, okay, now give me your egg. Okay, you, you need to give me your feather. You didn't drop any... I have a looting one sword, and... I mean, I have a looting... Yeah, a looting one sword, and you don't drop me any feathers. You are a butthole. Like, a butthole of epic proportions. I don't even want to know. Alright, so let's go ahead and let's try and find some more here since it's daytime. Since that's going to be, like, our only other shot at arrows at this point. Um, I'm not sure if... 
the feathers. I think a feather, a uh, stick, and a flint. What does it? Ma it either makes one arrow or it makes four. I can't. I can't remember what it is. I mean, obviously in realistic terms, that would make one arrow, but. I don't know. For some reason, my brain's telling me that it makes four for some reason. I don't know. I'm probably very wrong on that. But yeah, let's go ahead and let's head off in this direction. I I know that uh, if we trek this area, we'll be able to find uh, the end portal. I think it's off in that mountain biome, but I'm not 100% sure on that. But yeah, let's try and find some chickens here out in the daytime, you know, because and then let's head back. Let's make some arrows, and then we'll end, up, end off the episode there or something. Let's see. Or I, rather, I don't want to spend the entire day looking for them. Man, that lava that's out there is like my best friend because it's like the one thing telling me where I am because every time I make the trek from my old house way out there to here, I always see that lava thing and I'm like, I know where I am. I always know exactly where I am because of it. Chicken, you can't hide because of me. Or you can't hide from me. That's what I thought. You guys see that? He was like creeping up from the, uh, from the hill there. He's just like, his eyes were just poking out as if he was looking looking for me, but he didn't want to be seen. Yeah, I, I, I know the way that they play. And they, they can't hide from me. So, right. Ugh. Oh, chicken. Chicken. Dead. <laughs> I have way too much fun with this sometimes. I almost feel sadistic. But you know what? They, again, there it's always a price to pay for being a chicken. Chicken, chicken's got a hard knock life, you know, gangster, yo, like that. That's what's up. All right, let's go ahead and let's create some arrows here. Uh, then maybe look around a little bit more for some chickens, and then pro. Well then. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I have never in my life had that happen to me. <laughs> I've never once just been lollygagging around and fall directly into a hole. I'm usually very good at avoiding those, but you learn something new every single day. And today I learned that even there's no escaping those tiny little holes in the earth. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's go and let's create some arrows here. Uh, where's the flint at? I believe I have the flint in the solid blocks, Jess, because that makes a lot of sense. Let's take these as well. Let's see. Shut up. I'm not giving you any food. So let's see. Does it give one arrow? No, it does give four, as I originally suspected. I just couldn't remember. Okay, so th that's going to be fairly useful, I guess. It's it's a bit better than I was uh, thinking it would be. So 34 arrows. We might be able to work with that, but I would like to get a few more just to be safe. Maybe some snowballs as well, if there is a snow biome anywhere near us, but I don't recall ever seeing one. Uh, at least not in this world. Okay, so let's do that. Let's do that, that, that. Okay, so 13 versus the 5 here. So that's going to give us up to 54 arrows. That's a really good amount, I would say. Um, because I'm, I'm going to try and avoid using them against the Ender Dragon himself. But what I will probably wind up doing is I will wind up using them just on the towers. So that'll be awesome. Let's go ahead and let's, uh, let's organize our inventory here. Or well, put everything back to where it belongs. Let's see. Spider eyes belong here. Bones belong here. Sticks belong in here. The bow belongs with the spare items, uh, with the spare tools chest. Yeah, I'm really, I really want to be particular about this this time. I might even create, like, another chest just as a junk drawer so I can, uh, I can just drop things in it as I please later on. I really feel that the flint should be in the drops chest. Yeah, I think that's a good idea. Let's put that in the drops chest. Even if it's not a, a mob drop chest, it's still going to work for me. So there's that. Okay, we got a flower apparently along the way. Let's see. Dirt goes in here. Yeah, I'm, I'm really particular, guys. So these are both new record discs that we got this time. So I'm going to have to look up to see which ones we have left. I know there's a few. Um, I know Cat is one of them for sure. Um, we got Stall. Let's see. I'm trying. There's also, there's two more green ones that I need to get. Like there's this one. There's Cat. I, I just can't even remember. You know what? I'm, I'm going to look it up. Mid-video. Discs Minecraft. I'm going to Google that. There we go. Music discs. Okay. So let's see. We have Wall. We have 13, we don't have cat, we have, do we have blocks? Let's see, no, let's see, no, so we, we need blocks as well. We have chirp, I think, yep, we have chirp, we have two of those. Do we have far, let's see, no, we are, so we are missing quite a few. So anyways, the list goes, uh, there is, 
There is Wait 13, Cat, Blocks, Chirp, Far, Mall, Mellow High, or I think it's Mellow High, Stall, Strad, Ward, 11, and Wait. Um, did I say Wait twice? I think I did. Well, there's two item IDs for it, so don't blame me. Or no, there's there's only one. I was reading off of the wrong part of the list on the Minecraft wiki. So anyways, guys, hope you all have enjoyed this, uh, this video, and I know Harpo has as well. He just sits here, because wolves are, like, pointless. They're cool and all to travel with you, like... He's cool for Kurt J. Mac, who avoids all mobs and he just needs a companion on his trips. But for trips where I'm killing, actively killing mobs, not the greatest idea. Not the greatest idea because they die so easily and they take up so much food. So anyways, guys, hope you all have enjoyed this episode of One Life Achiever. My name is Nat Venom, and I bid you all farewell. Thanks so much for watching.